Were you, were you crying? No, of course not. Mm -hmm. Sam. I mean, you, you look like you were, you were crying. I have allergies. Since when? Did you go see Claudia? Yeah, but that can wait. Why don't you just... Later, go? what happened? I uh, did what we talked about. I told Claudia Devlin has recordings that could expose the person who ordered the hit on Sonny. How'd she react? She was careful not to, but I think I got to her. Want a drink? Actually, I'd rather have an answer. Why don't you tell me what's going on? Fair warning. Because this is going to sound really juvenile. My mother hates me. It really hurts my feelings. There's a part of me that can stand back and see it from Alexis's point of view and gets it. My career path went from con artist to PI, my personal path. Man to man. And I have spent pretty much most of my life with low self-esteem. I mean, I agree with Alexis. If I were her, I would not want Christina and Molly to make the same mistakes that I have. Yeah, right. But that's not a good enough reason to keep you away from your sisters. Really? Because mm -hmm. Alexis doesn't even know that I took Christina to the woman's clinic okay. to get contraceptives. If, if you hadn't, is Christina still going to have sex? Oh, yeah, of course she is. She's going to do whatever it is that she wants right, to so do. Right, so it's better that she's protected. I know that, but Alexis isn't going to see it that way. You can't let Alexis tell you how you feel. I know that you love your sisters. I've seen it. You were not bad for them. You were good for them, Sam. God, Jesus. I really needed to hear that. I kind of think it's ironic that my mother sleeps with a psycho like Jerry Jackson and then wants to lecture me on the likes of a guy like you. Alexis might have a point with that one. Okay, I mean, I, in a mother's mind, I can see her wanting a little, hey, at least you have a good heart. Right? I don't know. What do you think? Hold that thought. Hold on. Hello? Anybody here? Who's gonna be in there? You wanna because I needed your advice on a case that I'm working on. Okay, I'd like to help. Good. Um, so this client that I have under surveillance, mm -hmm. she left her apartment this morning and she didn't show up to her office and I actually was downtown for so long and stuck in all this traffic I wound up losing her. Well, did you check her office? Yeah. 
course. Well, then you know what? Maybe we should break into her apartment and see if we can find some clues. No, um, that's probably not a, a really good idea. Well, come on, if she's missing. No, no, can... Okay. Fine. I made the whole thing up. I just really wanted to see you. What am I going to do with you? I had to say something to Spinelli because he couldn't wait to marry Maxie and then he gets in here and all of a sudden he's at the altar and he changes his mind. Uh, no, I was actually as surprised as you. Hmm. Hmm. Something you said definitely hit a nerve. Yeah, I mean, if I, if I give him any advice, I just told him to... Really? Mm -hmm. Well, I guess that's what he needed to hear. Because if we thought... I thought about it. I mean, it wasn't really a wedding, so I'm not really... Uh, 
this. Oh, no, 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 no. No, let's try. I know where you're going with that. It's not going to happen. That seems to really want you here. You're staying here. Besides, you did ask me how to be. It's kind of rude to just bow. <laughs> Man, you owe it to Spinelli. Get out I there. Know, so what? <laughs> 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 okay, uh, uh, Brenda Hermes, God of Strength and Flexibility. Oh! <laughs> oh. Jason, I guess you cannot escape what the gods are planned for you. <laughs> <laughs> okay, now it's time for the bouquet toss. All the single ladies, line up. No, 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 no. You didn't want to do it. I don't want to. I don't want to go anywhere. Well, you see that, that got me. Yeah. No thanks. <laughs> okay, are you ladies ready? Yes. All right. One. Samantha, evidence that the stars are perfectly aligned. Well, I'm glad they're not here tonight. Yep. You're recovering from two gunshot wounds and you need to rest and I need to go to the office and work. Is something that has to be done tonight? Well, no. I'd like you to stay. Over if he knew that you and Jason are upstairs making passionate love. 